I could be one of many. 주진 코니 닷테 나를 Technology is obviously always evolving. Video games are scaring a lot of people as these evolving features come out. Before we know it, we may not be able to tell the difference between it and our real life personas. I am meta human. Andy here. Now, a new project is really scaring a lot of people because essentially we're looking at video games that are becoming so realistic we can't tell the difference anymore. A lot of people are wondering is this safe? Is this going to be something that we see? replicated anywhere else, but obviously let's let's talk about it. The newest feature Epic Games Unreal Engine 4 was shock and awe from a lot of people. Although it did have a few worried about the future, celebrities like Elon Musk and more were left short for words on Twitter. The new project named MetaHumans is definitely causing an uproar. Now the project developer Unreal Engine has been at the forefront of a lot of games since the 1990s obviously. They've made a lot of games including Kingdom Hearts and Fortnite and these games essentially are becoming so realistic a lot of people are loving that factor. A lot of people are also scared of that factor of how close we are with graphic design, software, and more that are simulating real life events. Out! Brief candle! <laughs> Life's but a walking shadow. Now, if you didn't know, hundreds of games have used these engines, but if you ever played some of the more realistic ones, you would notice that the quality of the characters hasn't made the same leaps other features have. The most noticeable would be when virtual characters talk. Their mouths don't move the same way ours do, and MetaHuman seems to tackle this crucial characteristic a lot better than previous versions. Developers have been putting in its built-in motion tracking software to test, and the results have been very promising. Now, people across the board are wondering, especially online, what this deems as the future for video games, but also at the same time, people are wondering, is this free? Is this a problem? Can people do it with ease? And yes, it's free. Epic Games clearly wants to put creativity first and see where the software can bring us. This means that if you have the time and are willing to put in the effort, you can incorporate this into any passion project of yours without worrying about whether or not you can use it. The program can take some getting used to if you've never used anything like it before. If this is something you find exciting, it's probably a good idea to start working with it now. Epic Games has promised that this is only beginning and looking back at the track record, they're most likely telling the truth with all these possibilities. The real question is what you can't create with a tool like this. So obviously this is really cool because you get to play video games that are so realistic it hurts, but also at the same time it makes people like me wonder, are they going to essentially make real life events look real or fake because we can't tell the difference between video games and reality anymore. But let us know what what's trending with your opinions and for more social media news daily, head to whatstrain.com, follow me at Andy Wani, maybe we'll see you play some video games soon. Who knows?